hi guys welcome back to another video thank you guys so much for coming back to another video if it's your first video you know what to do guys hit that subscribe button almost at 5,000 subscribers guys hit that subscribe button and get me over that target really really appreciate it if you're coming back to another video guys thank you guys so much for coming back to another video really 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 appreciate it now in today's video guys we will be going to value We've gone to value village in a while and a lot of persons are always reaching out to me asking me like what our cost is like the cost for like uh used closing second and closing so we're gonna go to value village probably need a pan so i'll grab a, grab a pan so i haven't been to value village in a little while taking you guys with us show you guys what value village look like and of course of course of course showing you guys what grand prairie looks like most importantly if you like the video guys consider smashing a like on the video drop a comment Mumsy, you're going the wrong way. Mommy, you're going the wrong way. Go with mommy. These are just like some um, wall stuff. I think, but you wanna buy them in a second hand. I'm gonna say, yeah. yeah, like even plates and stuff. You can get them; they're relatively cheap in a dollar store. I don't know why would they sell them in a second hand? Three ninety nine. But probably these probably more expensive. No, but I don't know. I wouldn't buy these second hand though. <laughs> Curling iron? <laughs> like how much for these new? Like um rough estimate. <laughs> Coffee maker? This is for the coffee drinkers, but some of these look really old though and dirty. What are these? A microphone. Headphones, it's not really bad. Well, what do you want to buy the light? Stick. Is it for cell phone? Selfie stick. How much for this? $3.99. Monopod. Monopod. Let's see. Monopod. Yeah. But that is for Android users. Yeah. <laughs> 
tree that had 99. Relatively good condition. And if you need like microphone, um, $7.99. These are not bad. Malik, well, Malika earmuff. Hey, don't climb out. These are like our swimmers. Do we need to buy anything for like um, them swimming lessons when, when them officially start? Everything is provided? Lots of books. Mystery and crime. No surprises there. Spy and war. <laughs> Science fiction. Hmm? Yeah, four books. Buy four books. Get a fifth one free. Oh, she's excited. She wants it. She wants it. You have to say yes. What about you, Malika? Want any of these books? I'm gonna get some. Tooks. Just so you guys can get an idea. $3.49. $3.99. These are just winter toques. You second hand of course. <laughs> Where's it? Uh, pyjama versus um donate our pyjamas. <laughs> I don't know if I'll Yeah like pillows is not bad. $3.99 These are like for a coach pillow Yeah, like towels and stuff now These curtains So if we can grab a one pants while we're in here. Not not jeans pants, dress pants. Just want to be. See if we can get any deal while I'm here, guys. I'm a little bit ashamed about my pants size, so I won't like this part. So here's the thing guys, I usually find it difficult to buy pants, um, not just in Valley Village but in Canada in general where I'm at because I can't seem to get that cut, you know like like the cut, if you, honest, if you know you know, like either it's too big or it just got run. So I found this pants, seems like it has the cut that I'm looking for, ish right? Size look alright, but tell me now, why as soon as we find something we like it, it costs $17. Everything else costs $10, 
eleven dollars, nine dollars. But the one that I like, that, that the one that I really like, seventeen dollars. But not are you gonna be paid, paid for it from? You need it, you want it. You want, want it, it anyway. Okay. It's not anything, you just want it. So okay. It. So it's a nuts bill. I'll take it. Thank you. Yeah. One of the hotel bad. <laughs> Molika is shopping. What are you looking for? Female section, big room. They are like three quarters of the store is female section. And then one little part run out, two little aisles. <laughs> <laughs> it's mad. Oh my gosh. What do you think about the prices in Valley Village though? Do you think it's reasonable or do you think it's too expensive something for second hand things? Something that too expensive. Yeah? Um, yeah, sometimes it makes sense to just go and buy stuff. Yeah. Some things are reasonable. It definitely gives you a start if it is that you need it. Mm -hmm. Come on, Lita. No handbag for you yet. Oh, you can't get your wedding dress in there tomorrow. <laughs> hey, babes, you can't get your wedding dress. Come on, more regular, you can't get your wedding dress. Malika, what are you doing? Come on, come on. Come, 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 come. Go. Malika is acting silly. Come on. All of this is what? Ladies shoes. Hey babes? Ladies shoes. So let me show you another example guys. So we're out of this is ladies shoes, right? And then I think it continues around here as well. Two sections. That's not bad. Kind of, kind of antique though. And then, men's section. Full stop. World not level, you know? World is not level. That's not, that's not a bad shoe. Does that look nice? That right there, straight ahead. You don't like this? Fourteen ninety nine. And what is Malaya doing all the way down there, so? Where's Malaya going? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Where would you wear that to? That, that one that you took up just now? I know, I know, but it's so colorful. Where would you wear this to? No way about straight to church. <laughs> yeah. Malika shopping for shoes. Those are bigger than your foot, mama. You need a size 10. Kid size or size 11. Yeah. You want anything that you like? $8? Well, I'm Pamela, please. Okay. I'm not doing. I don't want that wedge. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, that's the phase where as everyone gets a hug these days. <laughs> I see that's the other day pick her from school. I'll appear and get that hug from Malika before we left. <laughs> I had to stand up and wait. <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> That's nice. And this looks pretty new. Yeah. That is new. How much for it? No, hold on to that one. Buy that. Um, what size is it? 10.5. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. Malika and Malia, both of you guys, come on. Get everyone across. <laughs> yeah, this is nice. 
How much is the fee? Six dollars. Six dollars? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, what well, about that one? Come, we're going to we are going to the cashier, young lady. <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice keyboard, Monica. That's awesome. I'm going to play something first. Back in the car guys, so we're just waiting on the window to defrost. Yes, you heard that right. <laughs> uh, the little time we we're in on Valu Village, the glass all got fogged up. Is that a word? Fog it up? Fog it up. Or fogged up? Fog it up. <laughs> fog it up. <laughs> oh my gosh. So um that's Valu Village. Yeah, I can. Yeah, this is good to go, but it's just your glass now, but that's fine. So I'll go on. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's go to um East Link first and then on the way home. We'll just stop around. Cause we're not gonna be at East Link too long. Maybe. Probably 30 minutes or 45 minutes stops. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's running from the sun. Malia, take some sunshine man. Take some sunshine. You were born in Canada, but you're still Jamaican. Don't forget. Yeah, that was Valley Village, guys. Now, now Valley Village is always a div divisive topic in terms of like immigrants. Now, some immigrants don't like to buy second-hand things, and that's totally fine. But some um, know the benefits of doing it and choose to do it. Now, if you choose to do it, hopefully this video showed you guys an example of some of the stuff that you can get in Valley Village. Um, there are times when there are more stuff and times when there are less stuff. So depending on when you get here, oh, the sun is so bright. Uh -huh. my eyes uh, you see that aura around me in the video? Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, so depending on when you get um, to Canada, some of the stuff that you see might not be there or some additional stuff might be there. Mm -hmm. Also, I'm not sure if the cost factor changed depending on where you are in Canada, but um, that's really based on what is in Grand Prairie. Um, so that being said, take that with a grain of salt. But ultimately speaking, I find that Valley Village tend to have newer stuff than Goodwill. Yes. Now, That's when I go to Goodwill, or when we used to go to Goodwill, because we haven't been there in a while, um, the stuff really looks second. <laughs> the stuff, the stuff Third in Goodwill. Eh? Third 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 <laughs> the stuff in Goodwill, um, it kind of have a, a whole other look to it. So you can see that it's used. So sometimes you might find some good stuff in Goodwill, but the chances are for finding something good in Goodwill is almost not almost. It's well, definitely. We haven't been there in a while, so we can't even see. Talking it. about when we when we yeah. have, the last time we have been there, the, mm. or the last couple of times um, we have it, been there. It's been like three times, and we're like, okay, that's it. Not no going more. back to Goodwill. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah, I don't know, and and also the pricing in Goodwill. It's almost like it's it's like way 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 some of the things are rare like very um overpriced. overpriced based on the quality. Some stuff it have a rip, a tear, like a lot of stuff that you can see. Say. It has been beat out before. <laughs> <laughs> you can see say it has been beat out before. Like somebody had something, they rinse it until there's nothing left in it and then they donate it. And then Goodwill we find that usually try to sell that at a very expensive price. So we're like, nah. nah. Valley Village do have some stuff that you can say, yeah, that's really old as well. But you do have this odd time, like for example, the shoes that we bought. Just tell me, let me show them the shoes, babe. See shoes right there, sir. Like for example, we got these shoes. Oh, the sun, the beautiful sun. We got these shoes, guys. Now this shoes is brand new. 
as you can see it's a new shoes based on the bottom never been worn or washed extremely well <laughs> one of the two uh, and you can see it no nothing and we got this for six dollars for malika so sometimes you can get a deal right six dollars see the price there inside not tell like um sometimes you can get a deal it's new brand never brand, it's never been worn you can see it so that's the thing with value village you might get the the, the odd time that you get a very good deal a new item and stuff like that for a very good price so that's why um if it is that we're gonna go second and we tend to go to value village because not always I find good stuff at Valo Village as well. I'm always looking for good stuff. <laughs> looking for next to new or new. I can't seem to find nothing good whenever I go to Valo Village. Next to new or new. And also, we find that especially when it comes on to buying things for kids, like Malika and Malia. Why me cut off? Yeah. yeah, this is. Yeah. We find that buying stuff for kids like Malika and Malia. It don't really make sense to buy it second hand. No, makes, no makes Because you you have stores like you have a a, a kid store just, that is similar to Value Village, just called Once Upon a Child. Once Upon a Child sell um used kids clothing, usually in good condition for the most part, yeah. but it's usually at the same price as, a as what you get it in Old Navy for for brand new. So if you're in Grand Prairie or in Alberta, you want kids stuff, go to Old Navy. We find that only they always have deal and kids closing and you get it for almost the same prices yeah, that you'll get it second hand. Yeah. Apart from all navy, where else would you suggest that they can get kids closing well, brand new? Carters. Hmm? Carter. Carters? Yeah. Have we been to Carters before? I've been there a couple times. Been there a couple of times. Yeah. yeah. But definitely all navy would be my recommendation because it seems like them they have a lot. No, because you're, you're responding, you're basically thinking about the deal that we got like like a, three weeks ago. <laughs> that was a good deal though. That was a good deal. I'm sliding down in my chair so my head is not cut off, guys. We're <laughs> <laughs> <Like> really <Yeah>. sharp. <laughs> the thing keep falling down. It's probably too tight near the, the yeah. tripod thing. I don't know. But this is rather comfortable, so I'll just keep driving like this. So we're going to East Link right now, um, just to... Uh, Hang out a little bit with the kids. They haven't been to any farm or park or are that turn here? Hmm? Yeah, eight to four. No. No, I don't. I don't go back on. Sorry, I don't turn your side already, I guess. I don't and Mr. Sharp, Mr. Sharp, Sharp, I can't see through the thing. I guess. Alright, that's it. Yeah, of course it's right here, sir. Yeah, they haven't been to the park much this summer. This I wish it was summer. This winter. So I'm just taking them to an indoor play area for a little bit. Get them out of the house. Still have to lie down in the chair. <laughs> I, can't, I can't even see. Here go. Oh. That's fine, yes. That's fine, that's fine. Furthermore, you guys probably don't even want to see us anymore. So let's just show you guys what outside is looking like. Nice and sunny, but sunshine don't mean warm. No. It's, it's very cold. <laughs> very, very cold, guys. Lord, I want to send um, a huge shout out to one of our subscribers. Um, they, are, they have also been on this YouTube journey with us for a number of years. Uh, we found out recently that um, his wife is diagnosed with cancer. So we just want to send some positive vibration to the Martin crew um, coming from the Andersons. I know that I know that um, must be very tough right now and there's no amount of words that can that can give you guys the comfort that you really need but we just want to let you guys know that we are thinking about you guys and um moms they just keep fighting right um just a sense strength positive vibration and all all the good things that the world have to offer in your direction mr martin just keep strong um just just keep hold on and we know say uh, with kids especially it's tough because now you're being a mother and a father as it is right now and at least until mommy recover because we have to be confident and be positive that that day is coming so just accept our strength and our positive vibration from the andersons them's are nuts 
over to you guys all right big up on yourself big up on yourself big up on yourself